author Olivia Resentera is presenting her latest work. But this reading circle isn't in a bookstore or on a college campus. It's in a prison rec room. The way an author speaks to her readers is unique. It only happens through books. The French nonprofit Read Your Way Out organized this event and gave these women copies of Resentera's Le Garçon a week ago. Their mission is to get more prisoners across France reading books. In a way, books force you to think about yourself, to think about others, and to think about your environment. The program came to French prisons 18 months ago. Wherever it's available, it's hugely popular, with 10 times the participation rate of other activities. I really like this book. I've never read a book with so many pages so quickly. By responding in writing to books they've read, prisoners can shave time off their sentences. But prison guards like this one say that's far from being the program's biggest benefit. Just look at the bars on the windows. It's a way to escape virtually, with words anyway. I can't say I've observed them taking fewer meds, far from it. But I have seen a calming effect. The calming effect on the prisoners who signed up for this program is undeniable. Before leaving, one inmate gets her copy of Le Garçon signed by the author. For her, reading it was more than a way to pass the time. The mother in the book is exactly the same age as my own mother. And so, I'm a little emotional. Because actually, prison keeps us from seeing our parents' age. And we don't see our children grow up. But we don't see our parents grow old either. Within the next four years, Read Your Way Out hopes to reach 50 prisons across the country and put books in the hands of some 10,000 prisoners.